Hello everybody and welcome. I am Cassis Plays and today we are checking out the release of The Cycle Frontier. Uh, it's a free-to-play game on uh, Steam that just recently uh, came out. I believe it's in 1.0 now. Um, and it, previously it came out into beta for a while. It didn't do the greatest and then they put it down to rework it. Um, and now I believe it's fully out. So. I wanted to get a few first impressions, see how the uh, tutorial is, and jump into a full game. And later today, I might be doing a little bit of recording with uh, Soldier Pat, who is in a ton of my other Let's Plays uh, co-op versions. So we'll see how it goes. But uh, for now, if you guys enjoy the video, definitely leave a like on it, subscribe for more. Let me know if you want to see more of this, and we'll take it from there. some actual prospect equip your scanner and look around for minerals mineral scanner so it's when you drop in basically you have a uh, okay there's a bunch of minerals over there it seems like uh, you have like a quest log which is this right here I just did the kill a strider that's like the first one it gives you um, and now the second one, I guess, is equip the scanner and help you find nickel veins. So it looks like there's probably some over here. Time for some honest hard work. Use your pickaxe to crack that rock open and check for minerals. Equip the pickaxe and we'll start hacking and slashing. Oh god. Got it. Okay. Okay. Pay attention to your safe pockets. But on the real fortune or whatever you uh, do, you bring back home. Even if you don't make it back in one piece. So just as like a quick like uh, impression, it kind of feels like a little bit of an environment or PvE like a Tarkov in a way. Where you have uh Items you can put into your safe pocket that you'll bring out with you. Um, it is kind of cool how there's a quest log officially in game. Whoa. Oh boy. I do need to change my, uh, it seems like, yeah, right now it's hold to aim down sight. I want to change that to toggle, but I'll wait until after we're, we're out of this uh, match here. When you do try to stop, it actually doesn't, uh, pause. Cause I, th I think each match is technically, uh, an open world and you can see and run into other players. So it kind of makes sense with that. This long shot's pretty cool. Interact. Oops. Wait, am I supposed to go up there or down here? Interact with consumable box smoke grenade. Guess we're supposed to go up here. Right, I'm just running around towards the evac. Reload. Holy. Uh, okay, I'm here. Now what? 
Oh, press Y to call evac. I did not see that at the top. <laughs> You'll need to be extra careful if you're still down there when a storm kicks up. No pilot's gonna risk flying their evac ship through that hell just for you. Uh, I need to heal up. Let's go one more. And one more. Beautiful. There's our way out. Kind of has like a Borderlands feel to it in a way. With the enemy killing and... Alright, I'm going, I'm going. Stay in ship until takeoff or evac. I'm staying, I'm staying. Evacuation successful. Tutorial simulation complete. Nice. Choose your prospector. Now let's get a good look. Uh, you can change your prospector and customize further anytime you're in the station. If you played the old version of the cycle, you'll find your unlocked items and uh, later in the following menus. Okay. So these are all like the default skins. Cool, cool. This will go with Gemini. Might as well. This art looks pretty cool. I keep seeing this every time. It kind of reminds me of uh, my enlisted thumbnail that I was using for the longest time. So it was similar. There was one guy around the corner and the other guy, the Axis guy is around the corner as well. So you're the new arrival. Okay. Login bonus. Is this like a public hub, I guess? Yep. Okay, I didn't know it turned into this. This city looks pretty cool too. It's like a space station, I guess. There's a planet. Launch to deploy. Or uh launch terminal. Okay. I wasn't expecting this, but that's uh that's actually kind of cool. Talk to Batum at the Lucky Leafman Bar. So you want to be a prospector? Well, first things first. Head to the Faction HQs. They'll give you some work to do. Okay. So there's three different factions. Or Korolev. What's up, Korolev? Ah, a new prospector. Vadim. Come to work with Korolev. Huh? Korolev are the industry guys. They keep the station powered and the factories running. They put jobs out for raw materials and old machinery. Their gear's nothing fancy, but it always works and packs a punch. Okay, so that's one. Uh, there's a Discord logo. <laughs> I will say this uh, base here is pretty cool. Welcome to the ICA. ICA. Sauce keeps the station going. Ah, the Independent Civilian Advisory. Their job is to keep the station and everyone on it alive. So yours is to get them whatever they ask for. ICA's gear is almost all designed and built Wait, on Wait, can the I station. walk on this? Oh, Boy it looks like here. it's water. It's good stuff. Well-rounded. Another prospect. Osiris. Good. Osiris always needs more people in the field. Osiris are only here to research all the weird stuff on the surface. They'll have you hunting down alien beasts one day and picking pretty flowers the next. High tech is their game. Hmm. Top of the line. Over specialized and fiddly, if you ask me. You'll need some gear before dropping down if you plan to survive. I'll get you started with some spares. Come back to the bar. All right, back over to Lucky Leafman. Hey. Free gear Granted rewards. Holy. <laughs> Open your inventory to check your loadout. Got it. Thanks. That's a lot of stuff you just gave me. Your safe pockets won't 
be able to carry all your loot. Small backpack. backpack. Good. You don't want to go down there unarmed. Pick a weapon to equip. Uh, sure. We'll go with the pistol. Now, remember to take some ammo. Make sure and shotgun. You choose light, medium, shotgun. You get the idea. A quick grenade throw or emergency health stem could make all the difference. No ammo. Do we have shotgun? Shotgun ammo? Can I only bring like a stack? Like, do I have to bring this whole thing? Uh, split item. Yeah, there we go. I'd rather bring like only 80 rounds, I guess. Not even that, to be honest. Maybe like 60. Ah, whatever. We'll leave it. We'll leave that. Uh, weak stem. Is there like a take one, not take all? Shields are a necessity. Unless you're one of those crazy scavengers that drop down near naked. Your head makes for a pretty target down there, so don't forget a helmet. A mineral scanner will help you find valuable ores. A must have for any real prospector. Okay, you're all set. Head to the launch terminal. From there, you can start your first drop onto Fortuna 3. You may want okay. to insure some of your gear. You won't get the full value back, but it beats nothing if you get knocked out. Ah. Yeah, same thing. So basically, if you get knocked out, you lose everything. Uh, or you can insure it. So if we go to deploy to Fortuna. And then there's bright sands and crescent falls difficulty hard definitely stick with bright sands do i have to or can i uh my inventory can i insure it now fortuna pass no season running any claimed uh you're entitled to or automatically added to your account We have 250 of whatever currency that is. Okay, I guess we'll select map. Ah, here's where you can, uh, let's, I guess, uh, standard insurance. I don't know. Sure. 700. Just to test it. I don't know if we actually need it or not, but just to test it anyways, we might as well. All right, let's go ahead and deploy. Oh, wait, it was 1,700. I guess they probably take like a tax. Here we go, we're dropping in. Showtime. Okay. Oh God. Uh, what did I just walk into? Are these other people deploying too? Hold left alt to talk and press T to talk. Push the talk if you're using a microphone. I forgot to check how to do uh ADS sprint toggle targeting toggle on. Sprint toggle, we'll leave that off. Crouch toggle, we'll leave that on. Objectives. All right. Uh, deliver nickel, deliver com compound sheets, and hunt a strider. So I have a pistol. Holy crap, that's loud. I'm all the way over here. Wow. The map's actually pretty, pretty big. And looks pretty cool too. Um, I don't know if there if this is full on like PVE or PvP. It sounds like it might be PvP as well. I guess we'll find out one way or another. Water facility, moderate damage. 
prospector. Prospector. See the guy. Hunt the strider complete. He's really shooting at me. Okay, bro. We don't have to do this. Yeah, my bad. I thought that was an NPC. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good then. <laughs> I was curious if there was PvP anyways. Sorry? I guess there is. I won't kill him then. All right, I'm not gonna. If he attacks me, it's a different story. But for now, find an evac location. I, dude, I don't even deliver a nickel. Uh, we need to find compound sheets. Mineral scanner. So you can complete one uh, one objective and then. Just walk away if you really want to. I don't see any. I don't know if there's fall damage. There we go. There's a ton. Do you always have a pickaxe on you? Uh oh. Wait, where'd my health go? Did I not bring a... Oh, I don't think I've, I brought a med pen. Where is this stuff at? Moderate danger. I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. Ah, oh, god damn. Hi, ay, ay. I accidentally threw a grenade. Damn. I wonder if you can even wait, can you even party up with somebody and like drop in together? Or is it only like solo? Looks like you still got things done. Head to the right faction and claim your reward. Okay, cool. Go to the faction HQ and complete your mission. So we completed this one. Greetings. But I think the other ones we have to bring in uh Very well. We have to actually deliver stuff. Faction market. Click the sell tab. Here you can sell items uh, from your stash to gain K marks and faction reputation. Remember, no refunds. Don't sell anything you don't need. Or sell anything you don't need. Or don't sell things you need.
Okay, you can see what I have equipped now too. Since I don't have the backpack on anymore. Here's a few materials and some K marks for a job well done. Now put them to use over at the public gear printer. Go to the public gear, gear printer. There. It'll make your life as a prospector a whole lot easier. Trust me. Why don't you go ahead and make yourself a new bag? Ooh, medium backpack. You can always put in for a rush job. It's not free, but your time isn't either. Uh, wait for a printing to complete or skip the timer. How much does it cost? Prospect Station provides its name. I'd rather wait. Their own private quarters. Ooh. I called in a favor and got you a place early. Right next door, too. You can thank me later. Just keep the factions happy and stay out of trouble. Well, enough okay. to chat. Go check out your new home. Have a look into upgrading your quarters. It takes effort, but it's worth it. Let's start with unlocking your supply crate generator. Generators? upgrade the station the station helps you back construct get you ammo stems guns whatever a prospect ah okay that makes me less uh nervous this about you can pick up your supply weapons as well as any salvage and insurance packages upgrade okay so you get shotguns sweet reward for keeping this place running that's about all i can do for you kid now go make a name for yourself. Sweet. Okay. So there is upgrades. There's like a whole area you can continue to upgrade. Yep. See that? We got some pizza. He's watching something on TV. Interesting. This is a cool game. It's a. Uh, Kind of has like your objectives it has open world like searching the the whole map i wonder how big the actual map like i know obviously the map is decent when you look at it um but i wonder how big it actually is like running from like end to end and things like that um I'll take the basic stuff again uh sure i'll bring this pistol I'm assuming you can probably find stuff out there. So without a backpack, you have zero to zero slots. So essentially backpacks are required. O is for friends. Okay, so I'm guessing that's how you can probably drop in with, with other people. Uh, required for upgrades, K marks and R. Okay, cool. Yeah, see, I'm glad I didn't bring that whole like 100 and whatever it was. Uh, 250 rounds. <laughs> There's no need for all that. I'll bring 40. 40 of that. Um,. I guess this time around yeah this time around we'll bring this too oh you know what I'll bring the 170 then okay uh do we have any heals or where can I get heals actually is that one of these windfall shop Maybe it's this quick shop. Yeah, here we go. Consumables, weak stim. Oh, okay. It's actually pretty cheap. What about like ammo? Like what if I needed a weapon? 1,000. 17. Okay. Some ammo. Consumables. Yeah, I'll take a uh, weak stim, I guess. Actually, let's try a med kit one week sim now does it put it into my inventory or into my stash it puts it into your stash it looks like 100% health boost and we have four of these go in with this so our objectives now uh, deliver nickel 
deliver uh, compound sheets down in any structure and containers. All right, select map, go in. Uh, sure, we'll, I guess, ensure these two. It's not I'm here to flag them for salvage attempt if you fail to evac. Sure. We'll just ensure that. I mean, honestly, the weapon, if the weapons are so cheap, then it probably costs the same as insuring as it does. We're actually buying a new one. Sorry, I was taking a drink. Okay, here we are. We pull out the, uh, oh no. Did I not bring a mineral scanner? Oh no. Well, nothing in here. Looks like it's already been looted. I am at the crashed drill. I wish there was like a basic like scan button. Man, I really didn't bring a mineral scanner at all. Okay, we have compound sheets. Uh, which one is that? Drop that there. It's for my quest, so. Might as well. Deliver water weed filaments. Roads around lakes and uh, other still waters in Fortuna. Okay, we got some water up ahead here. Not exactly sure what I'm grabbing right now. But I am grabbing what I can. Uh, I'm scared that there is fall damage. Oh no, jeez. Okay, well. That hurt, but But I'm okay. Go ahead and use one of these. There's really not like any type of basic like scan. gas grenade some ammo deliver water weed filaments grows around lakes and other still waters on fortuna and deliver nickel okay so you always have a You always have a pickaxe. This doesn't like highlight anything. The 
style of this game also kind of reminds me a little bit of like dauntless which is always a cool game i never really like fully got into it because i was always kind of playing other stuff but i always wanted to go back to it nothing it would be nice if I knew what it actually looked like or if I brought a scanner with me. Either one of those would have been helpful, but I didn't. And that's my fault. I thought I did have a scanner on me, unfortunately. 91. the hell is this what are you what the hell are you I can't kill it okay oh I already hate those things Hear shots over there. Is this an extract location? Oh no, they change. Okay. I'm gonna make my way to the extract and then see if we can grab anything along the way. If not, that's fine. We'll just uh, extract anyways. I think this is where I died the last round. So if I'm correct, there might be some minerals up here. Yeah, like right there. Yep. Also, come on. This would be like a perfect spot for whatever that thing that I need is. Is there like a uh, take all something? I'm gonna throw these down here. Oh, not enough space. Oh, I need to go that way.
All right, we got two things done. Let's see if we can make our way out then. What the hell is this? Almost there. Yep, I hear it. Grab as much as I can. Go, go, go. Whew. Oh my God, I was getting nervous there. <laughs> Oh, man. Nice. We got two of them done there. Okay. No active jobs. Visit the prospect. Killer Eagle. Cool. Go ahead and try to see if we can hand these in real quick. That's pretty cool. I think this game's fun. I um, it's definitely like a casual Tarkov style game, but I, I kind of like that about it, in my opinion. Oh, thanks, Windows Defender. Anything yeah, just scan notice? while I'm playing some games. That's fine. To it complete. See you again soon. Time to punch. Uh, that's the K guy. Where is that? Cyrus is there. Over there. There it is. So each one of them has part two. Now, this game has, like, mixed reviews right now on, on Steam. I'm, I'll have to read over why. But um, it might be from the previous release, too, though. But overall, I think it's cool. I think this would be fun, uh, you know, playing with some friends as well. Running around, collecting stuff, gearing up, all that good stuff per usual um how do i get back to my room just want to see if if any of the stuff that i picked up here it is if it actually uh can be used for any upgrades upgrades none there inventory maybe Increase stash size size for each upgrade. Increase the safe pocket capacity for each upgrade. And then there's this. Okay. Yeah, no upgrades there. Well, uh, with that said, I think that's going to be the end for this episode here. If you guys do want to see some more, definitely leave a like um, on the video. Let me know in the comments if you're checking out this game or if you plan on checking it out. It is free to play. It is on Steam. Um, so, yeah. I think I'm probably going to be jumping into it a little bit later today uh, at the time of recording this with my buddy Soldier Pat, possibly not 100% sure. So we might be having a part two come out. Uh, but if you want to see that, subscribe anyways, because uh, tons of other Let's Plays down the line. For now, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.